the Watercolour Society of Victoria visited the State Library for an excursion to view some of the parts of this library that are not always on view to the general public. It's a fabulous building, but it was equally exciting to get into their private rooms and have a look at some of the works in their collection. We were thrilled to be able to see a recently acquired rare book by Mary Gartside about a theory of colour that was published in 1808. She is virtually unknown in the art world, but her theories rivaled the greats. And this book was hand coloured with her coloured mixtures and they were so vibrant and quite modern in their impact. It was interesting to read her theories and it was such a treat to be able to have access to this rare book. We were intrigued by the background to the collection and some of the works that they had. This book was published in 1870 by Carolyn Peebles and it was a collection of watercolours of fruit, flowers, vegetables. And this too was a delight and intrigued many of our participants to get a close up look at these where you could actually feel the textures of the objects painted. There was lots of discussion and a lot involved around the Melbourne 20s presentation album of 21 original paintings. And then there was a calendar book of watercolours month by month. And these were so fresh and delightful. We saw other examples about the, of the original prints from the Birds collection, from the Fire Station Print Studio album, and also Lee Hobbs' sketchbook. And then we were back in the Melbourne sunshine after a truly inspiring afternoon. This event was part of an extension from our presentation on artists' books. And if you want to join us and become part of this vibrant group, go to our website and sign up.